Hey guys, Callie went back to mama's to sit for a second. Dolly had to go potty. So I'm going around the circle one more time and then we'll be with Callie. So if, and the deer are looking for her because she usually feeds the deer and they are looking for her. And I'm completely out of breath. Ooh, loud it. Um, hey Bobby. Hey, Doreen. I promise we'll be back in two seconds, back over there where she's at. Hey, Lynn. Hey, Melissa. Um, hey, Karen. I am dying. Hey, Shelby. It is hot here, but I need to do this. I need to do this more than I, more than I do. Hey, Jesse. Hey, Madeline. Hey, Melissa. Um, the girls and Chase and Bree were wa walking with me and the girls had to stop and I lost Brie. So, hey Wendy, hey Shauna, I promise I'm going around this circle and we'll be right there where Callie's at. So hang on, hang tight. It is hot here in Georgia. Um, Callie is doing good. She just had, um, thank you Sandra. I need somebody to cheer me on. Um, and this is not necessarily lo lose weight. It's just to try to get myself my, I need to, I have a thing that I got for my brother. It is like a workout machine. Thank you, Lisa. Um, and I need to do that too, but whew, but I need to walk. Um, okay. So Callie is doing good. She just had a little bit of, a, um, cramps um and so she is doing better usually um i know this may be tmi but i'm just gonna tell it um at the um that time of the month she has a really bad 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 migraine and has really bad cramps and it makes her sick so um she's been battling that so anyway she's doing good Sorry, I'm, uh, thank y'all for cheering me on. Um, I don't know what the temperature is out here, but it is very hot. It's better now because there's like a little bit of a breeze and the, the sun is not beating down. But, um, and I can't wait for y'all to see the pool. And I'm walking right in front of my mom and dad. So I got the water on Callie's golf cart. So we got, um, we got, Callie goes, who are you talking to? Um, so, I'm almost there. I just have to make this turn and I'm going back. Um, I would do it early in the morning. Oh no, maybe that's not what they're asking me. Hold on. Um, hang on, somebody. Your followers? Oh, Danny, praying for you in the morning for your chemo treatments um oh. oh my goodness we're supposed to get some rain um molly if i could get ever make myself do it i love it because it releases like anxiety and it releases stress and i love it and once I make myself, it's just getting out and making myself Will you do take it. take me around one more time? I want to see if that deer is Absolutely. Uh, this out there, absolutely it is. Okay, so Callie wants me to take her on the golf cart. I'm going to feed. Okay. Do you have food? Yeah, we got food down in the basement. Okay, so tell Papa you want to get some food. Hey, Papa. He wants to get some food for the deer. Okay, here you go. Hold this. You'll have to hold it wrong. No, we'll feed it. No, we'll feed it when we come back. Back. I'm gonna call it over here. Where are you going? I'm going. She wants to go around to the Wait back. Wait a minute. <laughs> <laughs> you to, Cal, you have to pay attention. To Sorry, that. guys. I have fried my brain. Funny. I'm so hot. <laughs> yeah. We're going to give Granny a little push. Give her a little push. It is in, it is in forward. Be careful. No, I got it in reverse. Oh, sorry. Okay. Where it, are you going? I look, like Where are y'all going, mess. Marie? Bree, Bree, hang on and I'm coming, I'm going with y'all, hang on, don't leave, 
Hold on. Where are y'all? Where are we going? I know. Hold on. I'm coming. Callie, you you ain't sorry. So, where are y'all doing today? Here, I can hold it. And okay, so we are riding on the golf cart, going to see if we see the deer. Really quick, hold her. Um, it was right here. It hears the golf cart and it knows Callie has food. Uh, yeah, baby. Yeah, dear. It's right there in this thicket somewhere. Uh, no, watch her. Look. Watch her be fat. I mean, I am dying. It's so hot. Um, no, it's Callie just had really, really, it, and some months are worse than the other. Um, she has really, really, really bad cramps and really, really bad migraines. And so, um, it's been pretty good and mild so far, but I'm just a few, I'm just. She had a. I'm just a few days in, so it could yeah. get worse. Well, and and the other day they're asking about the other day when you didn't go live, and I knew that they. I told them you were having stomach issues, and that's what we yeah. told them. So, okay, so. Ellie, we got that. My grandkids are crazy. Um, it is so hot. Um, oh, Madeline, I'm sorry, you got an earache. Oh, I I had one of them. Are they? Oh, the kids are playing hide and seek. Okay. Um. Just. Oh, bless your heart, Jesse. Uh, we're supposed to get rain at the end of the week. Um, but we're yes. having record temperatures right now. It's really hot. Like, really, really, really hot. Can you tell, like, um, everything's sticking? Yeah. It's sticky, um, Machinous. sticky hot. Um, Sorry, Dolly. I know I'm on the, doing the wrong thing. Hold her. Oh, oh. Okay. Okay. Sorry. Um. Do you guys want to witness something incredible? Do you see if Papa? Well, we might need you. You need to ask him where does he want you to feed it at, and see if he if it's we, okay. We're gonna do it. We was gonna do it down at the cabin. Whitney, I have these to put on. Kit, Chase, um, tomorrow night, can you help me put these things on 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 the boutique? Okay, so tomorrow night, Chase is right here. Tomorrow night, we will have these on the boutique. Um, these earrings, the blessed necklaces, um, and a couple of other things. We'll have those on the, uh, um, on the boutique tomorrow night. So, um, um, absolutely, Susan. Yes, we will. Um, where are you going to feed it at, Callie? Wait, is that okay though, Daddy? Cause we'll eat your stuff. They ain't but one. Don't, Callie, bring me Dolly, and you can go down there with Papa. Okay, so I'm gonna hold Dolly while she goes down there. Um, huh? No, she she's just sees the um, other dogs. No, no noise. Come on. No noise. No noise. Um. Oh, yes, absolutely. Praying for you. Uh, you know what? No noise. She's going to be right there. She's right there. She's coming back. She's coming back. You want to go with her? <laughs> do you hear? She's wanting her mama. Uh, she's going to say mama. Do you hear? She's fixing to say mama. She's right. She's go We're going. We're going. You can go with mama. Oh, you can go, well, Mama. Okay, hold on, guys. I'm gonna... oh, you can go. You can go. No, not don't. No, you can go with me. Hold on. Hold on. Hang on, guys. Hold on. Shh. You're gonna scare the deer. Ha, ha. No noise. No noise. You're going. Hang on, guys. Dolly. No noise. Chaseman. Hold on, guys. Chaseman. Lord. 
have mercy. Yes, she is crying for her mama, but she's got to learn that she can, can walk off five feet and no noise, no noise, no noise, no noise. She, um, mm -mm, no. She has to, uh, no noise. Dolly, no, no, no noise. She's crazy. It has, um, we are good. It's supposed to get rain, um, the, the Friday, um, it's just a, she is a mess. Dolly, no noise. No noise. It's supposed to be like, yes, it's almost, it's out, it's supposed to be like up in the, almost in the hundreds. Well, Friday they said it was a little bit of rain, right? Or am I wrong? They changed it. Oh, well, I may be wrong then. I thought they said, they, they did. They said it last night, a small chance of rain on Friday uh, with a little bit of band coming through. Um, oh, yeah, it's, it's humid here. That's, um, no, that's why it is uh, like I look like I've been drenched in the water. Um, it is, um, bless her heart, I know. No noise. No. I have to keep telling her no noise because she, uh, no, no noise. No. No noise. Hold on. She's trying to get to Callie. And she will pu pull me down the hill. Uh, no, she does not, Victoria. She does not want to stay with me. She wants to go with Callie. And um, right now, I don't want her to go down there because um, I don't want the deer to get spooked and charge at Callie. So until she... Thank you, Jennifer. Until she learns to... Um, um, not to do that, then she can, she has to stay with me while she feeds the deer. But she's been, we've been practicing it. Um, do you know what the temperature was today, Mama? 88. Is that all? Yeah, it's supposed to be 90 today. Oh, okay, so it was only 88 today, but it felt, well, what was the temperature with the humidity? It had to be way up in the 90s today with the, um. Well, I don't think it was. Madeline, she is, uh, uh, no noise. That is what she does when Callie walks off from her. And she is literally like, what? No. No noise. 20, maybe 20 feet at the most from Callie. And, um. Uh -uh. Oh, really, Carolyn? Bless your heart. We've been, well, we haven't been on here the last two days because Callie hasn't been feeling well. Dolly. No. God bless her. She just gets worse worse than worse about ate a bug no um but she can see her she just wants to be right beside her side and that's not really good because if something wants to happen to Callie and like if she had to have a test done or something like that where she can't go with Callie she needs to learn to be patient and wait for her but during the pandemic they have uh no, we don't want the deer to be frightened. Um, and they could charge because they have been known to do that um, um, here. Like, we, it, it did it one time with, um, I took doll, Doodle out to the bathroom. And um, and it charged at me because I was between its baby and, and it. So, um, I don't want, Dolly, I don't want that to happen down there. So, I don't want her to start doing that and then the deer charge at her. But anyway, so no, Dolly. And there's a lot of people walking too, so. Um, oh, thank you, Carolyn. You're so sweet. Thank you. I look pretty rough. I've been walking. And now I'm sitting on this golf cart leather, or looks like leather seat, and it um, is hot, and then I am sweating. It is terrible. It is very humid, like very humid. Sally, they will be on the boutique. Um, if you look up True Love's Kiss Boutique, um, www.trueloveskissboutique, then, um, tomorrow they will be, tomorrow night we'll be putting them on there. And I'll tell you what, I will, I will have them on there right before I go live. Um, we're in Georgia. Oh no, Kimmy, bless your heart. Uh-uh, no noise. Um, uh, Pastor Keith is at home. He had a rough day at work. So he is at home. Um, Dolly, hush. He is at home, um, sort of just having some quiet time. No, sh 
she doesn't understand Victoria, but she's fine. She understands that. Okay, so let me finish saying that because I've, I've got all jumbled up. Okay, so with Doodle, Doodle and Callie were, you know, like, say, when Callie was sometimes, when Callie would do therapy, I would take Doodle out and, and train with him, okay? So he was used to being separated at times, not much, but at times. He understood that there was times where Callie had to be one place, and there's the kids. Do you see them? And then we would be another. So anyway, but with um, with the uh, pandemic, Dolly and Callie have been inseparable. Like when I mean in the house, they are right beside each other, um, day and night. Even taking a shower, she lays in the shower floor right beside the shower. Um, free to know we have not been down the river. Um, I would love to do that though. Um, but. Um, they're, they have never been separated. So she doesn't understand that sometimes um, there's times that Callie needs to walk off five feet from her. And she does not get that at all. Um, when we were filming, um, she had a hard time with it, but she got a little bit better um, with it. But um, she just doesn't understand that sometimes Callie, you know, I mean, at home, even going to the bathroom, she is right with Callie. Going, uh, brushing her teeth, combing her hair, taking a shower, eating. They're never separated, ever separated. So she doesn't understand that. So it's it's good um, for her to be separated from Callie. It sounds like it's, some of y'all may um, sound like it's cruel or whatever, but it's not. She just needs to understand that sometimes that she has to be, you know, that Callie can't, can't be right with her. So, Dolly, no noise. Do, um, so, anyway, that's what we're doing. We're trying to teach her that she's, she's looking straight at Callie. Look, here's Dolly. There's Callie. And that looks like a long way from right here, but it's not. It's like, I mean, like, um, right at her. So, and we're not far, Carolyn. We're not, um, I mean, Anita, we're not far from Cornelia at all. We live in Gainesville. Uh-uh. No. No, no, ma'am. Um. Oh my gosh, Michelle, that is so funny because our family that was here, I don't know if you saw the pictures that I posted, um, no noise, the pictures that I posted of our family being here, um, they are, uh, they went to Sonoya when they, um, whenever, Dolly, no ma'am, no ma'am, Callie's fine, um, they went to Sonoya, Georgia, whenever we, they left us in Gainesville to go back to Tampa, where they live. So that's funny that you, you're in Sonoya. Um, Savannah, we are probably, how far are we from Savannah? How far are we from Savannah, Georgia? Probably at the least four to five hours. Savannah? Moore. Yeah. I'm sure. Daddy, how far are we from Savannah? I would say we're at least um, four to five hours away. Yeah. Um, thank you, Madeline. She's a mess. She does. She does love her mama, and she's still a puppy, too. So, um, She's she's a good girl. I like, see now she's she's calming down because she sees her and she sees she's not going to go anywhere. So, and what I don't want to happen is, you know, for her to get so attached to Callie and 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 their their bond is amazing. But I don't want her to be so um, attached to Callie that she can't function without Callie. And I don't want it to make her sick whenever. Um, um, Callie is, um, you know, because I mean, you know, you just never know what's going to happen and you never, 
um, you know, the, the, you know, when she's at the hospital, she's able to go with her, but if something happened to where she wasn't able to go, or if something happened, I just don't want it to make Dolly sick either. And Callie would never forgive herself if she was separated from Callie and something happened and she, and it made Dolly sick. So she just, she's, she's fine now. She sees Callie and she sees Callie's coming back. So she's in, in five hours. Thank you. She's um good. So um, oh my gosh, Kara, where did you meet him at? Oh, Gloria, great. I'll look at him when I get off. Um, what was I going to tell you? Uh, um, pray for my, um, son-in-law again. I, I know y'all, I told y'all about his cousin getting killed and, um, sorry, I'm, I'm sweating and I'm itching all over. Um, we're in, we're in Gainesville, Georgia. Um, my mama said 100 miles. God bless her. It's 248 miles. Um, there's got my, got my workout. You got your workout. Hey, babe. All right. Hey, babe. Shoo, Daddy, it's hot, ain't it? Yeah, she went in. Um, hey, babe. Hey, but um, hey, babe. look at this. Hey, babe. Let's see. Hey, babe. She's happy. Her hey, mama's babe. back. See, I told you. Look at that. Oh, now she's kissing me, thanking me. She was like, oh, 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 there's my mama. There's my mama. Mommy's back. Oh, gosh. Oh, um, okay. I love you. All right, too. Daddy, we're going to motor on. Yeah, I'm going to take her back around the the, the uh, thing again just to see if we see the deer, and then we'll go on home. Because it's, I don't know what time it is, but it's got to be late. She's licking my leg. Yeah. Here, you see it? Yeah. Yeah. I'll ride around there and see if I see them. You okay? I got my work. Oh, it scared them. Yeah. Love you. I'll see you tomorrow. Thank you for letting her feed them. Bless her heart. That one kept watching her. Every time she'd come around the the circle on the golf cart, it would come out and look, stand there and look at her. So it 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 remembers the golf cart. If they, if they come up there and find that I put down, they'll be back. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Love you. All right, guys. Let's see. You hot, Callie? Callie's burning up. I'm painting my dog. Huh? You what? Oh, okay. Love you. Tell mom I love her. Um, we're going to go back around the circle one more time. Yeah? Yeah, I'm going to take her around here and see if I see the deer. I love you. I'll see you tomorrow. Love you. <laughs> My mama, bless her heart. Anyway, they're, they are, um, his cousin got killed and... Y'all, he was just 23 years old. He had just, oh, there oh. they are. They had, he had just graduated um, from college. And, babe, uh, I got the corn out there. It's he'll go, for he'll you. go now over there. There yeah, it is. There she goes. That's so sweet. I got the corn waiting for you out there. Um, he had go just, ahead. He Happy had just son. graduated from college Go ahead. and um, was getting married in August. She and, remembers. <coughs> she they, remember um, my boy. She's not scared of me. I anymore. know it. And um, he got killed. And so anyway, they are having his funeral tomorrow. So y'all, please pray for his family, the Fagan and Mathis family, and um, and his fiance. Um, I think her name is Kristen, so oh, okay, pray okay. for her. Wait. Um, but um, anyway, so we are headed home, and we'll do Daily Dose because we oh. haven't done Daily Dose. Hey, babe, it's down there. It's waiting for you. Look. I put it out there, but you couldn't see me because then people walking the dog scared you. I put it out there. It's out there, baby. Go get it. The cat Ooh, easy girl it's okay easy how sweet is easy that easy girl it's me remember i'm the girl that fed you every day it's okay 
I promise. It's okay. Oh, oh. there she goes. Oh, 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 oh there, there she go. goes. She's going to it now. Thank y'all for thank y'all. Um, they need a lot of prayer. That family needs a lot of prayer. I can't even imagine. Um, but anyway, um, um, that was the deer, and <laughs> she's been. Um, oh, it, Joey. It it's a sad. Um, oh gosh, it is so sad. So 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 sad. Um, he was a good boy and it was just an accident like a freak accident that happened he didn't have a place on him anywhere except for on his chin where a um, a pipe that was on a crane that he was helping um, navigate to where it was supposed to go um, just barely hit him and it broke his neck and so it is it is really bad I mean it's really a really sad um, sad sad um story and i just can't even imagine his grandpa was with him when it happened he was standing with him and so it's just it's really bad really sad sad story so um she, she knows, knows dolly's voice yes she, she does. does dolly dolly even liked her dolly's like sitting up trying to um see everything hold her but anyway so now we're going to go around through here and i'll turn this around how old is the dog? The Dolly is only nine months old. She'll be 10 months old um, the end of this month. So uh, her birthday's coming up. She'll be one. Yep, she'll be one in a couple of months. So they have a big golden doodle shindy. Yes, Valerie, absolutely you can, absolutely. So um, what'd she say? She wants to have a sleepover. Oh yeah. So now we're riding around the neighborhood absolutely Sonia that is exactly right and that's what Callie has taught me um, we you know we we don't know what God's plan is and you know sometimes you know we just did that devotion the other day about um, how you know that sometimes we don't understand what's happening and we don't understand why things happen the way that they do but God always has a plan and um, and we just have to you know trust and follow that plan and and um and trust in him and you know we don't always understand and and you know one day maybe we might know the reason and maybe one day we may not ever know the reason but we have to still trust in him and trust his plan and so um and this family has a lot of faith um and oh uh, they you know they they trust in the lord and one of the things that he loved to do most of all was sing at his church and now he is singing with the angels and um you know it's it it just it breaks my heart but you know we've had two sweet precious people um go home to be with the lord this week and um one of them was carly and she had never i mean she was not able to see but you know what the first person that she saw was the lord and how amazing is that and her mom and dad said that she's she's playing laughing and running and seeing all the sights in heaven and um one day we'll be there to to witness that also so um now we are so how late did kelly sleep on her first day out of school tony and carrie oh gosh. she has been getting up early um i did honestly. i slept until 803 this morning she slept until 8.03. She should be sleeping at least till like 8.30. But she, she gets up. She gets up and... Because uh, I don't want to get my mind off that schedule. Because what oh. if I do that and it is on a day of school? So she wants to stay on her schedule. I don't blame her because I'm a staying on a schedule type of person too. So um, we like to be on a schedule. Y'all, I can't wait to show y'all what the pool looks like now. It is cleared up. <laughs> Do you dare go out there with your frog situation? Oh, gosh. I don't know. I got to get this on camera. Callie said she has to get me on camera with the frogs. Um, Joey, I know. It's just a it's, a it's a bad situation. but I wish you guys could see how hard of a time I have catching these lizards around here. I am itching all over from sweating. Ugh. Um, I wish you guys could understand and see. Thank how you, Alexis. They said you did hard. It is wonderful on Sunday. You and Delaney. Thank you so much. 
they love to sing together. We do love to sing together. All right, so we're going to go around this little circle. There's around. a lot we love to do together. <laughs> yes, you're right. Delaney is doing so good, y'all. Um, I mean, really good. I'm so proud of her. Um, what was that? I have no idea. Um, they. Um, Can we go by the chicken lady's house? Yeah. So they put her on this this medication, um, three different medications, and um, the doctor thought that she would have to be on those three medications longer than she actually was. <laughs> but she finally got to where she could reason um, with herself and talk herself down out of these ep these anxiety um, episodes that she's been having. And so um, she um, okay. is doing uh, so much better. So this week when she went to the doctor last week on Wednesday, a week ago, they um, started weaning her off of some of her medication so now she's only on one medication and they think that she'll be able to come off of that too so I think with um, everything that happened and then with having the baby and her hormones going all over the place after the baby was born um, it just it just took a toll on her and she couldn't reason with herself to get herself down out of um, the panic that she got into and so um, not to mention her um, cold turkey quitting a medication that she should not have done. That added a lot to it too. So, but she's better. So, and she's at home and um, we're doing all good. Better. Yes, we're all better. There's the deers are back there. We're all better. Callie um, had a hard time with her sister um, having a hard time, but she's better. She's better. Callie's better. She feels better about it, and so. Yeah, we're blessed. Absolutely. Um, so, so, so blessed. So, let's see. She's moved all of her chickens. Kelly, I think she's moved them to the back. Um, the chicken lady has um, chickens. Kelly oh, likes to come. Goodness. Kelly likes to come and check out the chicken ladies. Um, well, me and her grandkids grew up together. Yes. They would always, they would always be walking through the neighborhood and they would stop by my house and uh -huh. we would build forts all around the house and play games together and now they're now they're all grown up and I'm grown up so yep with lives of their own so which is incredible I hope to see them again soon yes <laughs> it's been years ever since we saw each other so and they're twins too, right? Yes, they are. The baby is doing great. He weighs almost 13 pounds. Um, they do. They they do live right next door. I'm sorry. I probably should have told y'all. Callie, Callie has her her little trail that we go every day, um, and so I'm riding around in the neighborhood that we live in. So yes, my uh, um um. The, the place I'm riding around, the reason it's taking us so long is because we are riding around Callie's little trail um, through the neighborhood. Yeah, she I likes to go the same. Yeah, she has to wave at all the neighbors, check out where all the deer are. And um, so. Well, it's fun. So, hey! hey. <laughs> so, um, they um, like that right there. It's so sweet, absolutely sweet. Oh that my God. that little boy. He's Adorable. probably about two. He wanted to see Callie come back by. That's so precious. He said, "Hey, Dolly." He said, "Hey, Dolly." Oh, they may they probably follow you, Callie. So anyway, so we're fixing to pull in our house. So yes, um, my mom and daddy do live next door, but it took us a while because Callie likes to go her little um, route. So. Oh goodness. Oh goodness. Bless him. I thought that was a deer. I was about to say, oh my god. I am itching all over. Okay, okay, so now we're pulling in our driveway. Thank you. I'm so glad to. She called me last night. Um I don't know what time did it was, you get probably the mail yet today? I did. Um probably about nine, ten o'clock last night and she had worked in her backyard and on her back deck and fixed her back deck and she was so proud of it and um, she loves to um, 
to go out there with Landon. So y'all hang on, hang tight for two seconds. This is a tight squeeze. Um, oh Lord, Joey. Here comes Keith now, I it think. It just makes me so happy. Joey said, look, tap the, there's a frog in the in the road. There's daddy. Oh, Lord. Keith, am I, am I missing it over here? Yeah. Daddy's here. Didn't you have for Thank real you. while you were walking, Mom? Yes, I think so. Yes. Um, I think, I, 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 yes, I think that's what they meant too. And I, I, I that's why I didn't say anything. Um, I think that was just a typo because Lord knows that happens to me all the time. Um, get your phone, baby. Okay, so we're home now. There's Daddy. Daddy. Let me see if I can get up and walk now. After I walked all that over there, I'm, I'm so stiff, I can't walk. Okay, so here's Daddy's socks. Yes, it is. It's really Gatlin, Alexis is his name. Gatlin. There's Daddy's socks. He has boats, sailboats. Um, David, the baby's doing so good. Oh, here's Daddy. There's Daddy. Dad, will you run our precious girl Okay, let's to the see. Bathroom? I sure will. All right, and then Callie, Callie, come on, and, and I want you to talk to them because I feel like I've all I've done is talk, and I don't want nobody to get upset. Okay, hang on, guys. I want y'all to see the pool. Yay! It is. It's very light out here. Here's the pool. See how clear the pool is? It, um... It is um, all cleared up. Let me see if I can wrestle us up a frog over here. Now Callie's trying to find a frog. The birds are chirping tonight. Maybe there's no, maybe there's no frogs out tonight. Yeah, Tanya, I will absolutely. Did you send it to my my? Uh, Here's Callie. Tell them what you're looking for, Callie. Frog. What? Froggy. Froggy. Judy, I haven't seen your comments. <sighs> if you ask me again, I promise I will answer it. You want to sit with me? I will sit with you, but right now, won't you talk to them? Okay. Hey, guys. What have y'all been up to tonight? I am so sorry I haven't talked to y'all. I should have done a better job. Well, but you were... It is <laughs> It is. You 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 had a little bit of some um problems a couple of days, so you're good. You're good. They yeah. totally understand. Yeah. Oh, you guys my emotions have been up and down. Yes. She has. Oh a lot of a lot of stuff has been going on. A lot of our dear friends have had it people passed away or people that they Sick. really love in the hospital and mm -hmm. it's just it's just tore me up inside that I can't be there to support them so that's why my emotions happen everywhere it's about four a little over four feet deep it's the same depth all oh, the somebody way somebody asked me that question and I could not answer it because I did not know how deep our pool was. oh it's okay yeah, we put that pool in um, on Callie's. We had it, got it for her on her first birthday. Um, yeah, the frogs do get in Mavis, the pool. Mavis, yep, they sure do. That's uh, <laughs> that's where one of them was um, Saturday, was in the pool, and I just happened to look down, and there it was. Um, but, um, that's so funny. Gosh. Maybell, you have to let us know. They're having a Bigfoot festival in her town in North Carolina. Please, in August, please let us know. I'm coming. Um, oh, my gosh. See, here comes um, Dolly having a fit because Callie was out of her sight again. Okay. See? Okay. Right there she is, Mary. She went to Keith, took her to potty, and so that's Look what she good. does when she gets back with Callie. It's okay. Um, it's okay. Calm down. Damn it. Uh, oh, thank you, you Carrie. Um, I need to get that for her. There we go. So my eighth ah! birthday's coming Nora. up, you guys. Froggy went up courting and he did right. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh -huh. 
Oh my gosh. What song? Oh. Oh, yeah. Um, we were going to sing this because we thought about it the other night when we were talking about... Oh, yeah. um, Five little speckled frogs sitting on a wooden log eating some most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool where he was nice and cool. Now there are four speckled frogs. Croak, croak. Four little speckled frogs sat on a wooden log eating some most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One swam into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there are three speckled frogs. Ribbit, ribbit. Three little speckled frogs sat on a wooden log eating Shh. some most delicious bugs. Y yum, yum. 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 One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there are two speckled frogs. Ribbit, ribbit. Two little speckled frogs sat on a wooden log eating some most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One swam into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there is one speckled frog. Ribbit, ribbit. One little speckled Dolly, frog. Dolly, be still. Set on a speck <laughs> wooden log, eating some of those delicious bugs. Yum, yum. Then it swam into the pool where it was icy cool. Now there are zero speckled frogs. Oh, no. Zero <laughs> speckled frogs. Set on a speckled log, eating no delicious bugs. Yum, yum. Then none of them swam into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now they are all really hot. Dolly, calm down. Um, mm. Ours is, honestly, I don't remember what the the width is of it. Um, uh, seems like it may be a 27 or 28. I'm good, I guys. can't remember. I've just been. And then. Happy all the time. Oh my gosh, Joey said I was fixing to ask you to read, uh, to sing the F Speckled Frog song. I, I read your mind. Uh-huh, that's what he said. He said, you read my mind. Um, let's see, um, you got a friend in me. Let's see, hold on, um, excuse me, my stomach, I had some mango and now my stomach's happy. Amanda, um, can you tell me what it was, and I and I'll tell you because I, I don't know. Um, I usually tell what Callie gets, and I think we opened several when we got back, but I don't remember what they were. Um, Jeremiah was a bullfrog. He was a good friend of mine. <laughs> I forgot the rest of the song. <laughs> okay, so I don't remember. I think it was like a 27 or 28, maybe around. Oh, Bree's got a um, red bullfrog. And yes, we have not, um, we have not replaced the liner in several years. What movie I can't is remember. That on? It's only had one Seven. liner in it, and we've had it. We put it in on Callie's first birthday, so she'll be 18. Um, and so will the pool. Yes. Jeremiah was a bullfrog. He was a good friend of mine. He scared my mom half to death. <laughs> She's so funny. I'm trying to remit. Re um, you know, Ruthann, I don't know. You guys. Oh, absolutely, Tammy. They were here this weekend and swimming. You guys, you're never going to believe what happened to me today. What happened? Here we go again with with my curly dolly so i was um i was chasing lizards all day today yes judy yes she will absolutely dolly dolly yeah dolly <laughs> will go in the pool we have to take her to some swimming lessons first she will get in though yes speckled frogs oh have you ever who hasn't heard the speckled frog song Absolutely, Madeline. It's so hot out here, y'all. I'm about to die. I just want to jump Angela, in. oh my goodness. Tell us about your hilarious frog experiences. See, Callie, somebody said their husband used to work in the woods in Washington, North Carolina, and that's in the spooky woods because Bigfoot 
Then they heard weird noises early in the oh morning. Oh my gosh, that's my type of stuff. <laughs> Dolly. We may have to take her in and let her get some water. Yeah. Um, it's not done yet, Edie. Um, you okay? Okay, so, Jerry, I will have the cross necklaces and the cross earrings and some more earrings, different earrings, this week. Actually, tomorrow night, we'll have them on the... Um, I know I've told y'all that for a week now, but, um, Sherry, yes, I will tell you that in just a second. Um, we, um, I have to have, Ka uh, um, Chase's help. And so I just asked him if he would help me put those on there. So he said, yes. Um, okay. So, um, do I have siblings? I do. I have two brothers. I have an older brother, Terry, and a younger brother, Stacy. Um, and they're married, they have kids, um, and I have, um, a bunch of, well, not a bunch, I have, um, well, I do have several. My brother, Stacy, is married to Keith's sister, Karen. So, um, we have, um, nieces on that, and nephews on that side, and nieces and nephews on the other side, too, on my brother's side, on my, my other brother. So, yes, I have siblings, one older and one younger brothers. I don't have any sisters. Well, yeah, you do. You got sisters. I got sisters? In Christ. Uh, yes, <laughs> absolutely. Oh, my. <laughs> oh, Amanda. Um, okay, can you tell me what it was? <laughs> oh, gosh. She's laughing because the frogs are croaking now. Let's see. Oh my goodness, Tanya. Oh gosh, it is hot there. Lisa, girl, I'm telling you, if it ain't bees, it's frogs now and lizards. Uh, oh, Madeline, absolutely not. Oh, oh my gosh, it's Amanda, on the side you're of so the pool. sweet. Thank you. Yes, Kathy, you can. How many sisters does Callie have? I have three. Three and they're sisters. they're all married and they all have kids of their own. And actually, we're all... All four of us are about to go get our nails done together. Because that's what Mom got us for Mother's Day. So that thank we you, could you. all do it together. Oh, gosh, Robin. We have these, like, these little lizards. These little green lizards. And then some little brown lizards. And the blue tail lizards. Mm -hmm. So, we have different They're everywhere. species. Um, Deidre, I have not seen a message. Uh, yes, yes. Can um, I jump in the pool? Huh? Mom? <laughs> Chelsea, thank you. Huh? Yes. Huh? Um, let's go get her some water because she needs water. She's she's panting hard. Yes, yeah, she is. We're going to go in and get... Okay. Oh. Um, Virginia, she does that, um, sometimes. Who's the oldest of the three? Okay, so Amanda. the oldest is Amanda. Um, uh, Debbie. Oh my gosh. Uh. I want the followers um, to tell us about their funny stuff. Hang on a second, let me get up. Callie's birthday is June the 27th. Okay, so we're gonna go in so Dolly can get her some water. You're okay, Callie? Yeah. Um. Joey, they're not singing me no lullaby. Joey said the frogs are singing a lullaby to me, Callie. Oh, my. It's probably sitting right on the side of the... Where is it at? I don't see it, but it is. It's in this generator. Yeah, it's in the That thing is crazy. Uh, no, we're not camping. We're just sitting out in our backyard. Um, is that it, Amanda? Um, let's see. I think, I think, I know, I, I, I'm almost positive the one that we got is the one that you sent. And I showed it, I think it was the night after we got back or the night that we got back. I can't remember, but it had Almond Joys in it. It had, okay, so. Hey, we back, we're back, baby, back. 
Oh my gosh, Madeline, you ask us anything you want to ask us. Bless your heart. What time will you be live tomorrow? Same time. Edie, Callie, does the lizards bite? Um, yes. Valerie, I do still have your mom's Yes, book. but it does not hurt like you think it would. Callie likes to walk around with them stuck to her finger, biting yeah, her finger. And then if I, and then I'll have earrings because their little teeth are going to puncture a hole in my ear. Because I'm going to stick them up there, let them chomp down, and then remove them. Now I'll just stick an earring through the oh hole. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> What's today's date? The frogs. Oh my gosh, y'all. The frogs, you know, you love it. Callie reminded me today. Yes, they do. Callie reminded me today, June is almost here. I cannot Yay! believe. Um, That's my month. We celebrate it all month. Woo! I cannot believe that June is almost here, y'all. And I'm excited. You're excited? Yeah, my B day is coming up. Yes, Deidre. It's going to be so fun. Oh, my gosh. Um, we have got squirrels everywhere here. Um, oh, trust me. I want to go to the a place where they have the white squirrels. You do? Yeah. Have you ever seen white squirrels? They're such a thing. Um, so, how many of you guys you are tell me. celebrate? Excuse Ooh. me. Here, you hold this for a second while I get this so up. So, how many of you, know, you guys are having a birthday in um, June? I'm having a birthday. It's May the 24th. Oh, goodness. I used to have big iguanas. Oh, my gosh. Woo, girl. My goodness, I can only imagine. Yes, I will. You will what? Oh, Valerie's mom said, will you text her about the sleepover? Oh. <laughs> That's amazing. Callie's a little excited about 18. Yes, I'm excited about being 18. Oh, it seems like yesterday she was 14. Look I at know, these, I look know. At, look at these bags underneath my eyes. Can't you tell I'll be 18? <laughs> it seems like yesterday she was 14. Oh my gosh. Oh, I got the oh my frog gosh! Eyes. Somebody's mom's birthday is June. I can't. I didn't. I. I. It just flipped up so fast. June the thirteenth. That's mine and Keith's oh, anniversary. Oh my gosh! Oh, How many? Our anniversary is coming up. June the thirteenth, and we'll be married. How many oh years? my gosh! Someone said me June twenty seventh. Oh. How, Callie? You have to hold it down so they can see your face. Oh my goodness! What? How many years? Thirty four years. 34 years. We will be married 34 years. Oh, my gosh. Look at my frog eyes, Mom. <laughs> Don't you love them? Look deep down in them. I'm sure you're going to find your frog heart somewhere. Callie! <laughs> <laughs> Look into these animal lovers' eyes and find your frog heart. Callie, I love you, and I really want to find the frog heart, but... If that frog sucks onto my skin again, I just don't even know what's going to happen. You ain't going to kill it because I'm going to grab it. <laughs> You'll be trying to kick it off and I'll say, Mom, stop. <laughs> just let me pick it up off your foot. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. Wouldn't that be quite the life if Mom woke up with a tree frog on her nose? Keith's mom and dad lives about 20 minutes. 20 minutes. Well, actually, they did live about 20 minutes away. Um, about 15 or 20 minutes away. But they are actually selling their house. 
And um, they are moving to Maysville, Maysville, Homer area. Um, and so they'll be a little bit, not too much further away, but in a different direction. Um, and so they are actually in the process of selling their house and downsizing because they, it's just the two of them and they just want to be, um, want to downsize and they're selling the home that, um, Keith and Karen grew up in. So, well, pretty much grew up in, right? Yeah, pretty much grew up in. So, so yeah. it, ribbit, ribbit. I've been waiting to do that. Oh <laughs> Look gosh. at her face. Oh my goodness. Hold on. I got to. Okay. My mom's is June 3rd. She'll be 86. Oh my, oh my goodness. Gosh. Happy birthday. Oh, Cheryl said when she lived in New Albany, she had a white squirrel. Oh my gosh. Running around my fence. Oh, they're so cute. Oh my goodness, Judy. Her parents would have been married 69 years. Oh my gosh. My mom and dad, Keith, count this up. My mom and dad. We'll be married um, on our 25th. They were married for 50. So 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, eight years. So they've been married 58 years um, in July. Golly. I can't Keep believe it. Because I have to like count it all. Count I can't it. believe it. Oh. Look at that girl go. She can play baseball. <laughs> oh my gosh, she's jumping on Keith. Keith, she loves to play ball with Keith. It's oh. hilarious. Oh, mom. Yes. Shout out to all the frogs out there. <laughs> Give all the frogs a shout out. <laughs> I was I was texting a friend of mine today, and I was like, I've been chasing lizards all day long, and you laugh at me. And they said, that's so funny. And then I said, if you think the lizard story is funny, wait till you hear the story about my mom and her frog. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> Callie, Callie, Callie. Oh, my God. Dolly. Oh my gosh, I can just see you. She's just to kick she's just so head. mean. <laughs> oh, Vicky, I'm praying for you. I love you. Oh my goodness. I could only imagine what that was like. Joey said, What did Kermit the Frog ever do to me? That's just rude for me not to like frogs. <laughs> see, right? I mean, <laughs> I mean, he helped the girl in America, and I don't find a rainbow connection, so. <laughs> right? I mean, what did he do to you? <laughs> you were too funny, Callie. Remember when Kermit was singing that oh, rainbow yes, connection song? Yes, yes. The dreamers and lovers and me. <laughs> oh, my gosh. <laughs> oh, Lord. Oh my gosh, my chest hurts so bad. <laughs> oh Lord. Yes, we are. Yes, we are very blessed. Absolutely. We are. We have a lot of frogs that love us so much. <laughs> Where's the love, Dolly? Where's Let's the love? see. Where is the love? Oh Lord, Crystal said when she was 14, a frog got in the shower with her. That oh. would be my type of experience. Oh, that would be fun. Keith. If you even think, you even think about it. Oh, my word. I saw Keith's eyebrows go. Oh, cow. Uh-huh. I saw, I saw that. I will be locking myself in the bathroom from now on. Well, uh, you won't have no choice. The frog will be swimming around it with you while you're taking a bath. I will be locking myself in the shower in the bathroom. Look at Keith. 
Somebody want a pineapple? Look. <laughs> Drop it like it's hot with the pineapple. Mom in the mood for pineapple today. We're going to uh, have lots and lots of grilled pineapple this week. The hot weather makes me want cold um, fruits. Like, I don't know why, but I, I, I just don't even like to eat anything hot when it's hot outside. Um, oh, my goodness, you guys. This is so hilarious. What? What? Ruth, I'm praying hey. for your husband. So, you guys, this is hilarious. So, so, so hilarious. Just close your eyes for a second. No, right? I'm not closing my eyes around you and your daddy. And take yourself back to the place where the frog was on your foot and say, get, just hop on, hop on your way. Just get off. And then he'll just hop right off. <laughs> if you love me, you'll do it. <laughs> frog, get off my foot. Ah! I get all the of it. Oh my gosh. Joey! Joey said he's going to be a frog for Halloween and knock on my door. Ah! <laughs> 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 oh, my gosh. Let's see. Now, this I got to see. Thank you, Cheryl. The other night, we pranked her after we got off live. We took a gummy frog and set it on the railing outside. Mm -hmm. It was hilarious. Mm -hmm. Yes. Um, I got married um, four days after I graduated. I graduated on Tuesday, got married on Saturday, and we have been married for 34 oh years. Oh, my goodness. That is so romantic. No. Just so deep in love. Carolyn said, awesome sermon yesterday, Keith. Oh, thank you. Oh, my gosh, Joey. <laughs> Tomorrow, I'm going to text that friend and I'm going to be like my mom's chair by the frog. Um, Tammy, the frog, I did have a frog um, one time several years ago, years ago, before Callie was ever born. One jumped on my foot and sucked down to my foot and I couldn't get it off. <laughs> and ever since then, I've just, they're just so unpredictable and they just jump out of nowhere and they <laughs> stick to you. And I hate that. Um, so oh, that was so funny. Virginia said, you need to come to Arizona. They have all kind of lizards. We were supposed to come to Arizona this past June or July um, to the William Syndrome Convention. Canceled, and we were so yes. sad. I love it. I need you, froggy. <laughs> Callie, how old are you? I am 17. I'm going on 18. I just can't wait. Oh, my Lord. Uh, Corey and Kay wants to know, what are you ha doing for your birthday? I don't know what I'm doing for my birthday. We'll just wait and see. Dolly. Dolly. Okay, no. 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 <laughs> Dolly, no. Okay, Keith, you need to step on her um, on her leash. She's She can't do that. Yes, they do. It's so sweet. Um, Keith? Keith? No, Keith. So, guys, you guys know that I love frogs so much. One, two. Oh, my goodness, goodness. Dor Nora. Three. Dolly doesn't mind. She don't mess with them. She's, um... She loves every everybody and every animal. Oh gosh, that's probably the truth. He probably will give me a um. Tanner says give him give him a pineapple. Oh my goodness. <laughs> um, what was I saying? Um. Yes. I, what was I just saying? This man's laughing on TV. It's making me laugh. I just lost my train of thought. What was I talking about? I don't even remember. I don't mm. know. When the frog was stuck to your foot. No, that was a long time ago. Um. 
What do you say to the frog that is hitchhiking? I don't know. Hop on it. <laughs> Hop, Hop on, on in. in. Hop on in. Oh, my gosh. Oh, you my gosh. Awesome. Yes, they are the best. Georgia peaches. Woohoo! And you know, I'm a Georgia peach. Are you a Georgia peach? I'm grown. <laughs> you get it, Mom? Oh, my gosh, Virginia. I die. Um, Maggie, I'm so sorry about your mom. Uh, Praying for you. Peaches? Yes, we have Georgia peaches, Tanner. We have Georgia peaches. You're looking at one. <laughs> <laughs> Man, I wish they had some beauty contest to pick a Georgia peach. Me too, Rhonda. I just can't. Um, I just can't deal with. Um, when you're looking at me. You're looking at country. <laughs> oh Lord, she's so funny. I just can't um, eat. <coughs> I don't want to eat hot stuff when it's hot outside. Um, but let's see if I can. Um, you know yes, what? Valerie, I sure will. Absolutely. Oh, goodness. I have no idea what that was. Go see what that was. She got stuck. On what? On the, um, thing. Um, let's see. Oh, thank you, Sherry. Thank you. Um... Callie, what is that? Uh, let's see. Um, oh my gosh, I'm sorry. I'm so um. Um, I'm so, oh no, Amber, I'm praying for you. Oh my goodness. Um, Regina said you are a big, sweet Georgia peach. Uh -oh. <laughs> That's so sweet. Oh, Diane, yay, are you... Been in hot tub today once. Oh, yay. yay. Diane is uh, um, on a vacation. Oh, my God. The Georgia Peach Truck comes here once a week. Oh, yay, Irene. Um, we have, it's called Jaymore Farms, and we go up there Georgia. to get the peaches, and they're really good. They have all kind of vegetables and different things up there, but they have great peaches, and they have the best strawberries, too. They have Georgia Bells, Georgia Bell peaches. Mm. Um, sounds so tasty. Delicious. How far are we from Douglas? Douglas, Georgia. Is that down there where? It's down south, south Georgia. Okay, how down far? Central, uh, down Lincoln, I think. How, how, about how far are we? Uh, Somebody's asking. Two hours, about two hours. How far are we from Kennesaw? Okay, that's close that's to where so we go long. to training at. So it's about two hours. How how long uh, did over, how hour. long did Kelly sleep? Depending on the traffic, it could be a little over an hour. It could uh, be two hours. First day out of school, I slept in until seven. Shirley, absolutely, we will be praying for you. I keep a time. Kara, thank you. I keep a. Really I had a friend close. to make this. Um, I've had it, gosh, probably two years, and um, a friend made it for me. I keep a really close eye on what time I wake up in the morning, so I can tell you guys. <laughs> Woke up at 8.03. Oh my gosh, do you guys know Willie Spence on American Idol? I love him. Um. I'm in California. Love you. Oh, thank you, Lisa. Uh, let's see. Okay. Alright, so let's 
Let's do daily dose really quick because so, we've been on here for a while and I, I could say I'm trying I'm to keep so, up so, do, with the did comments. Did I do a bad job? Absolutely not. Why are you saying that? I don't know. I feel like I haven't talked as much. Well, because hey, Kathy, Kathy! I was thinking about you today. Um, I was thinking about you I'm driving down the road and um, and I couldn't tell. I'm so bad when I'm driving down the road. I I start thinking, you know, you, things are quieter in the car, and you and you think, and I and you, I had you on my mind today, and I wanted to um, send you a message, and then when I get home, I um I totally forgot. So I'm so glad that I seen I'm that sorry. your message. I would have reminded you if you had told me. I know, I know, and I should have. I, I've had you on my mind today. Uh, you know who I've had on my mind? Who? You. You've had me on my mind? I've head? had you on my mind all day long. Oh, well, thank you. That's so sweet. Me and my mommy are so close. Before we do the daily dose of true love, I got to tell them what we have planned for my birthday. Oh, okay. What your gift is. <laughs> Well, this is it's what not, Callie says she wants for really her birthday. A gift, 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 but it's kind of a gift, and I've never been anything like this before. So, but I want my mom and daddy to pick someone to take me out on my first date for my birthday. Isn't that fun, huh? And I, I. I know I got to know the person, but I don't want to be able to see the person. You want just, it to be a surprise date? Yeah. Have you ever heard of a blind date before? Oh, That's where Lord. It's somebody that you know, but you're blindfolded, and you can't know who they are till you get to the place that you're going, and you rip the blindfold off. Oh, okay. And you're like, oh, hey, so-and-so. I'm so glad it's you. <laughs> <laughs> Tanner said, what about me? Oh my gosh. Happy birthday, Angela. Isn't that funny, you guys? Yes. Yeah, uh, so, Callie, for her birthday, wants us to fix her up on a blind date and her, me and her daddy go with her. Yes. It's going to be fun because it'll be my, you know, first time. I know, Sheila, me too. That's exactly. <laughs> yeah. Absolutely, we love Tanner. Absolutely. I mean, He's sweetheart. Do you have, He's my son. Do you have anybody in mind? No. No. I got you. Carolyn said Baxley. <laughs> <laughs> That's exactly who Absolutely, I, Tanner. That's you most exactly certainly can. Who I was thinking about. Oh, Laura said we, we have to get their approval. Do you guys have my approval? I know the sweetest guy I've ever met in the world. Mm-hmm. Your dad, that her daddy says. the same, though. I'm her, not, I'm not. Her daddy's in there saying, just go with your daddy. That I'll be take the, you on a date. That wouldn't be the same, though. Okay, we'll talk about it. How about that? I mean, shoot, we already know <laughs> some people. We got Tanner. <laughs> oh, Lordy. Do I have y'all's approval? We'll, we seriously, we will consider that. We might, we might be a... I'm talking about my followers. I oh! Know, I know you and dad's going to talk about it. Oh, I just okay. need to know if I have my followers approved. Okay, so... <laughs> oh, my goodness. Absolutely, um, Tanner. You'll have to, um, we would love for you to come. Oh, Debbie said she can think of two. Um, for Callie's birthday. Oh, that's pretty fine. I know, that's what I said. Absolutely. That would be good. Uh, okay. So, let's do daily dose of true love. So, today's daily dose of true love is coming from Proverbs 17, 24. And let's see. Proverbs 17, 24 says, Wisdom is before him that hath understanding, but the eyes of a fool are in the ends of the earth. All right. 
So today's daily dose is called Wanderer. And it says, what is it about our hearts that tend to wander? We love the Lord so deeply and we want to follow him, but there are so many things that lead us away. Many times in life this can happen. There are so many things that tempt our hearts. The years can be difficult, but they can also be some of the best. Stay strong. Remember that you are God's child, and he knows you by name. Kelly sings a song, he knows my name. And he does. He knows us by name. He's a jealous for our hearts. Of, he's jealous of the hearts of his children. He doesn't want to share you with anything or anyone else that would harm you. So hold fast to his love. Don't allow things in, in this world to make you wonder. Be one of the few who choose to keep the, your eyes glued on wisdom and spend every moment you can living your best in his love. And that is so true. There's so many things that can... Um, let her go because she's, she's panting. She is so hot. Um, there's so many things in this world that tempts us and makes us wonder. And, and wondering just simply means that we get our eyes off the Lord and we start following something else instead of following the Lord. And it's easy to do that. And we're human and we're going to do that. But it, but we have to realize that we're, we've got our eyes focused on something else other than the Lord. And when we do realize that, then we need to, to quickly get our eyes back on the Lord. Um, the, he's he wants us to follow him he wants us to have our eyes on him he wants us to focus on him and his plan that he has for our lives and he wants us to follow that plan but sometimes you know just like i don't know if you've seen that little thing on um facebook and on i guess it's like a tiktok thing too where they put they they have a child and they've even did it with dogs now too but um, I think the, the little kids are the cutest thing, but they sit the kid down in a chair and they put like their favorite thing in front of them, like chocolate or ice cream or cookies or, oh, yeah, you know, the school videos yes. that we always watch. And they put that in front of them and they say, okay, I've got to run to the bathroom or I've got to run and put these clothes in the dryer and you don't touch this till I get back. If you don't touch it, you can have it. But if you eat it before I get back, then I'm going to take, you know, or I'm going to, you're not going to get any more or something, whatever. I don't exactly know exactly what they say to them. But they can't eat it until their parents get back. And it's, that's a temptation. That is put right there. And you, Lord, those little kids, they'll sit there and they'll smell it. <laughs> and then they'll touch it. And then they'll smell it. And one little, one little guy picks it up and licks it and he hurriedly puts it back down. That's just like temptations in this world. We're tempted with so much stuff. Um, being a teenager and a child right now growing up in this world, oh my gosh, it is so scary because there's so many temptations. And the TV just is like full of stuff. The music that we listen to, the, the stuff on the TV, all of that is so, it, it just tempts us and puts things in our head to make us wonder off, get our sights off of, of the Lord. You know, you'll be sitting watching TV, and I am so bad about this. You'll be sitting watching TV, and you won't be hungry at all, but then a Big Mac commercial comes on, or oh an ice cream gosh. commercial comes on. That's so me with the KFC commercial. And the KFC commercial comes on, and so that makes you start, in your head, makes you start wanting that. That's how... You go to the store and you see these nice shiny shoes. And I'm so bad about this because I love shoes and I love bags. I love bags. Um, any kind of bags. Um, and you, you know, you walk by and you see this bag and you're like, oh my gosh, that is beautiful. And you just, you're tempted. So that's what happens is you get your focus and, and it could be anything, anything that you're putting before the Lord 
if you've got your eyes set on that instead of on the Lord, then you're wandering off. And God doesn't want us to wander off because when we start getting our eyes off the Lord and we start focusing on something else, then the more that we do it, the worse it gets and the further you get away. And I read this thing today that said, um, it doesn't matter how far away that you get from the Lord, he's just one step backwards. The meaning that if you just turn around and walk one step, you're right there with him. So you need to, we need to keep our eyes focused on the Lord. And sometimes it's really hard. It's so, um, hard to, um, you know, stray away and, and because there is so many temptations in the world, but you know, once you see that you are wandering away from him, quickly get back to focus in your eyes on the Lord. Sometimes we don't understand his plan and sometimes we, you know, we wonder and we think, okay, this way might be a little bit better or a shorter route to get to where I'm going. Um, and, but it's not always God's plan. And, and, and we, and when we do that, we get our eyes off and we cause so much hurt and pain and scars and things on our life that we necessarily would not have there if we had just stayed focused on him. So I'm thankful that, um, many times I've wandered off the path, but I have got back on the path and God's forgave me and, and he set me firm back on my path. I will stray again. I know I will. Um, and, but God's always there waiting for us to come back to him. So, you know, we, it's hard to fight temptations. It's hard to, um, to, I mean, just like, I mean, every day I have to fight to not eat candy, I have to fight to not eat sweets. Yesterday, me and Keith were, um, we went to church and then we, uh, went and grabbed a burger really quick because we were going to see his family that was here from Florida, we were going to meet them at the park and to see them before they left um, going on their way back home. And so we grabbed a burger and we we ate on the way and we came home and changed our clothes really quick and then went to the park. Well, we went to the park and saw his family and um, we got back in the car and <laughs> We both were talking about we were hungry again. And so all, I, three of us. all three of us were hungry again. And I said, I vote. Yeah, I vote that we go home and eat. And he said, the rest of the ice cream cake. And I was like, yes. And so my intentions were that I was going to come home and eat two small pieces because Amanda had got a um, chocolate Oreo um, ice cream cake, and she got a strawberry cheesecake ice cream cake. So, I thought, okay, I'm going to eat two small slices of that, um, those ice cream cakes, because it was hot outside, and, um, you know, it just, I love, I mean, when I say I love, I love ice cream. And so, I thought, you know, I'll just eat two little pieces, and that'll be it, and then, you know, I'll be fine. Well, I ate two little pieces, and then I went back in there, and it was tempting me. And what did I do? I fell into that temptation, and I ate another piece. And then, and Callie's Sorry. laughing. And then last night, Brianna and the kids came, and after we took a golf cart ride, they came, got it back out, what was left of it. And um, I thought, I'm not eating any more of that. What did I do? I ate some more because it was tempting and I ate it. So it's easy to, when those things tempt us, it's easy to just fall into that temptation. But we have to keep our sights, our eyes on the Lord. And so um, I'm thankful that he's always there um, and he's always um, shining that light for us. But we have to purpose in our heart and in our minds that we are going to stay on his path and we're going to keep our eyes on him because he wants nothing but good for us. And I'm thankful for that. And sometimes the temptations that are calling us and pulling us causes scars and, and, um, hurt and pain in our lives. And we don't want that to happen. And, you know, sometimes, you know, we, we cause, 
the pain and the, and the suffering and the scars on our life because we've lost our focus. So don't be a wonderer. Stay focused on the Lord. Keep your eyes on the Lord and let him direct your path. Okay, I know, Laurie. No more ice cream cake. Big Thank God it's all gone. Big congratulations to Willie Spence for making it to the end. I, I know. Love Callie oh. was a little disappointed that Willie didn't win American Idol because he was such a good um, Christian man and oh, just sings for the to, Lord. He, just, he took them to church every time. That's what they said. Yes, they, he, he, um, today he would... We, videoed it and um i was listening to him sing and i just had cold chills um but you know what the lord has big plans for him i know yes, he does and he's actually got a youtube channel i follow it and it's so good and i know god's gonna do big things for his life and um so let's see oh my goodness oh. Oh my so, my, one of my temptations is ice cream. I love ice cream. One of my temptations is not eating ice cream. Oh, Joey, you're so sweet. I'm just kidding. You know what my real temptation is? Huh? Huh? You know what my temptation is? What? Not going to KFC. Landy, nobody had a birthday. We just had a little... Um, a little dinner, you know, the kids come over all the time, and um, we just wanted to cook out with the kids and just hang out, and they came over, and Amanda um, brought dessert, so she got a huge chocolate Oreo ice cream cake from Dairy Queen and a strawberry shortcake ice cream cake from Dairy Queen. It was amazing. Um, God is good all the time. So, what's another temptation of yours, Mom? Huh? Pocketbooks, shoes. <laughs> I'll just be honest. Mine is all and chocolate. restaurants. All restaurants. <laughs> my, that's my temptation. Oh, Lordy. If I see a KFC commercial, I want KFC. Do if I see a McDonald's thing. commercial, I, I want McDonald's. But I believe the best burger I've ever had, <laughs> burger I've ever had, was that Wendy Single Burger. There's nothing like it. Let me see this. Oh my goodness, Maggie! I completely, I, I, I know. And you know, once you um. And it seems like the temptations, and this is, I mean, just because just because I haven't had that same um, temptation, um, I can relate because, you know, there's different temptations. People have different temptations, but I know that, you know, once you, once that you surrender to that temptation, then sometimes it takes such a hold on you that you can't, you, you, um, it's hard to give it up. And, um, I know that, you know, I've often said, you know, I've never been addicted to alcohol or drugs or anything like that, but I'm addicted to Diet Mountain Dew and it's hard. It is, I mean, I can't imagine, um, you know, being addicted to drugs or alcohol and I, and and it's so easy to fall into that. And I, like I said earlier about, you know, the kids these days and um, even adults, you know, they, they, they do it maybe sometimes because they're, they're pressured into doing it or they're, they're, you know, other people are doing it. So to fit in, they want to do that. And then it just like sucks them in and then they get in a shape to where they can't get out of it and they just keep going deeper and deeper and deeper and um I'm proud of you I just I want to say I'm very proud of you for um getting your eyes focused back on the Lord and that he has helped you I am a firm believer in prayer I am a firm believer that God can help you through anything um it is up to us and our determination if we let him help us or not and I'm proud of you and stay strong 
and keep going. Keep your eyes on the Lord. I'm I'm very proud of you. Um, I love your hairstyle shirt. Oh my gosh, Callie, thank you. She's so funny. Um, <laughs> let's see. Oh, Valerie, really? Um, they're opening back up. Um, Callie, can you sing one verse of He Knows My Name? He knows my name. Every step that I take. Every move that I make. Every tear that I cry. He knows my name when I'm overwhelmed by the pain. Can't see the light of day. But I know I'll be just fine. He knows my name. I don't know what tomorrow may bring. I can't tell you what's in store. I don't know a lot of things. I don't know all the answers to your questions of life. But I know in whom I have believed in. He knows my name. And every step that I take, every move that I make, of every tear that I cry, He knows my name when I'm overwhelmed by the pain. I can't see the light of day, but I know I'll be just fine, cause He knows my name. Good job. Um, can you go get that toy? KSC is my weakness, y'all. <laughs> you are ready? Oh, mine too, Teal. Oh, my goodness. After all this time, it just um, opens. Let's see. I see your commercial on the TV. All right, guys, I guess we'll, we'll get off of here. Oh, my goodness, Denise. Callie loves Wendy's hamburgers. That's something that all oh, of a good. sudden Lord. she has so just good. absolutely fell in love with. Oh. And it's so funny because Callie will go through, mm -hmm. like, you know, like the Kentucky Fried Chicken now. She still loves Kentucky Fried Chicken. But, um, oh, my gosh, she, I'm in love. I wish I could have met the kentucky guy i would have been like oh my gosh thank you so much for coming up with such a brilliant idea i mean you got the k f c oh lord what is it shoot oh kentucky of course i was like what did the k stand for the f stands for fried. kentucky fried chicken oh she's Man, that's so some funny. of the best chicken i've ever had Oh, Lordy. Neil, if you're watching this and you need to go find... Oh, child. Yes, yeah, she did. Just went back and got it. Yeah, if you need if you need to go to a good restaurant, then I recommend KFC. Um. Okay, so I guess we will hop off of here. Good night, followers. Wait, you're not done talking yet. You go, go, man. Go, go. No, go, go, go. Either. I'm done. Oh, we're going to hop off here <laughs> so Callie can um, get her medicine, get in the bed, and we've been on here for a while. I know it. it we did a whole bunch of stuff, but thank y'all for being on here. We will thank be back you. tomorrow night for another Daily Dose of Frog Love. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm going to get a beat after this. <laughs> We will be back on here for Wait another night. Wait a minute. <laughs> I just called to say <laughs> I love you. <laughs> I just called to say how much I care. Are you trying to butter me up? No. <laughs> I'm trying to get your frog love going. I'm trying to help you find your heart for frogs. <laughs> I just ribbon it. <laughs> They say, I love you. <laughs> and I just riveted to sing a song to you. <laughs> oh, Lord. Oh, rivet, rivet, rivet. <laughs> huh? Now you found 
your frog love, huh? Callie, I love you. And I'm gonna get it after this. I would I would do anything for you. You anything. You would? <laughs> would you hold a frog? <laughs> but but <laughs> why do you keep saying that? to lizards? Yes. Do you draw the line when it comes to baby alligators? Now, I believe I could hold a baby alligator. What the heck? A baby alligator is more dangerous than a frog. They bite and frogs don't bite. Well, a baby alligator would have their mouth uh, taped together. And... I know, but a frog, it, he don't bite or anything. He just goes, squirrel, ribbit. <laughs> Yeah, but he's very unpredictable, and he sticks to you, and you can't get him off. I know. That's my favorite. He's slimy. He, he jumped on my shirt, and then he lifted it. <laughs> Look. Look. <laughs> I just can't. I just can't. She's literally ooh, has hair. That's like, ooh. Stuck up. Ooh, ooh. I just Do can't. that again. I can't. I just can't with a frog. I can't. Would you still love me the same if I if I if there was baby frogs swimming all over the pool? Callie. I think I saw one today swimming in there. We will definitely see you tomorrow night for another daily dose of <laughs> Mom and Frog Love. You're that getting... little frog better get his little booty out of that pool cause he's gonna be sucked up in the vacuum cleaner. I'm just kidding. There really wasn't one in there. I looked. Were you just aggravating me again? I got you. True love. True love. You and your daddy. I want to name my girl True Love, but then her last name would be True Love, so True Love, True Love. <laughs> <laughs> You're too funny. Uh, oh, Mary True Love, True Love. <laughs> Oh, Lord. I'm just kidding, y'all. I'm happy with Dolly. Y'all have no idea how happy I am with her. Oh, Lord. I want to eat her up. Laurie. Oh, no, no, oh, no. Oh, no, Connie don't like frogs either. Me either, Connie. And they, they are just killing me. Killing me yeah. over here. <laughs> They're everywhere. All right. Let's do the intro right. I meant that. <laughs> Exit. Outro. Okay. On YouTube, okay. we call it outro. So, Kat, we'll be back tomorrow night for another daily dose of True Love. True Love, True Love, True Love. Y'all better be spreading it around. And don't forget, True Love the Film. Yes, truelovethefilm.com tells you all about the, um, yay, Connie, I'm so proud for you. Um, um all about the Happy film. Dance. A Dose of True Love on TikTok. A Dose of True Love on Instagram. Callie True Love on YouTube. Yes, and follow a me. a look into Callie's heart is her um, Facebook page. And we will see you back tomorrow night for another Daily Dose of True, True Love. And boy, Sing it. we got it around here. Good night, followers. Well, it's time to go. Do, 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 do. Good night, followers. Well, it's time to go. Do, 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 I really do. hate to leave you. And you know the frogs outside? No, I hate to leave you. But I really must say, good night, followers. Good night. Ribbit, ribbit. Hopping around y'all states when the oh, film starts. Love you. Bye guys. Bye, guys.